Hello, Dr. Bruce Pinker here from Progressive Foot Care, wishing you and your family a happy Thanksgiving. In November, we raise awareness for diabetes. Did you know that over 30 million Americans have diabetes and around the globe, there are hundreds of millions of people with this disease. So with the upcoming holidays, I recommend that we try to think about moderation. Let's try to reduce the amount of carbohydrates that we eat, like stuffing, bread, desserts, Hopefully we can try to reduce these somewhat because when we eat more of these types of foods, which are high in sugar, it raises our blood sugar levels and it can actually create something in the blood called sorbitol. And we know for decades that sorbitol has a negative effect on our nerves in our body and it reduces the signals that are sent up and down our nerves too much of this can actually cause neuropathy a numbness, burning, or tingling in the feet and sometimes even in the hands. And this topic of sorbitol actually came up at a recent advanced surgical skills conference that I attended all about peripheral nerve surgery. So when it comes to our feet, let's examine our feet every day, check the top and bottom of our feet and also in between our toes. We should look for any cuts, scrapes, or bruises, and if there's a wound that hasn't healed within a few days, it should be seen by a podiatrist. And if you're a diabetic, there should be an annual foot exam for you at, at least once a year, and some patients who are at higher risk or elderly should see a podiatrist periodically to have this, the nails trimmed, to have the hard skin and the calluses reduced, uh, because if you cut too much or improperly, it could actually cause infections in the feet. So you shouldn't be doing this yourself. And these infections in some cases can actually lead to, unfortunately, amputations of toes or part of the foot. So let's try to prevent that at all costs. So check your feet and enjoy the holidays responsibly with your family. Our 15th annual holiday shoe drive for the homeless is well underway now for the past five weeks, and we've already received over 400 pairs of shoes. This is a tradition here at Progressive Foot Care, and we anticipate about a thousand pairs of shoes at the end of the shoe drive. We're working with some really wonderful organizations, the United Way of Rockland and Catholic Charities of Rockland, and also Caring for the Hungry and Homeless of Peekskill. It's also known as C-H-H-O-P. So why do we collect shoes? Well, we're trying to reduce the chances of infections and frostbite and even amputations in the less fortunate and the homeless. So if we can at least put shoes on their feet, we can protect them from snow, from frost, from the cold rain, and hopefully prevent these terrible infections from occurring. Now, everyone who donates shoes can get a raffle ticket. We have raffle prizes this year that are donated by local businesses. They've been very generous, and we have many, many really great gift certificates that are available as the raffle prizes. When you drop off shoes in either office, in Nanuet or in White Plains, you can get a raffle ticket at the front desk. So, we will have a drawing for these raffle prizes on Facebook Live, and that'll be on Wednesday, December 21st from the Nanuet office at 7 p.m. and Thursday, December 22nd, 7 p.m. also from the White Plains office. So follow us on Facebook. That's Progressive Foot Care of White Plains, New York and Nanuet, New York and like us, follow us. We have thousands of followers and you can watch the shoe drive prize drawings on Wednesday, December 21st, 7 p.m. and Thursday, December 22nd, 7 p.m. as well. So all the shoes benefit the less fortunate and hopefully you'll be able to support us again this year. So once again, thank you for your support and happy Thanksgiving to you and your family.